Okay, everyone wanted to see how the Cavendish experiment worked. Um, I made this with the red laser and I'm redoing it with the green laser um, just to see what happens. So here's my Cavendish uh, setup right here. So there's a wire hanging down to this horizontal bar with two masses. Those two masses are attracted to these large masses on the side right here. So, and then there's a laser right here and it bounces off all the way over to here. You see the dot right there. And that's just another reflection from the glass. Now, it is very sensitive. If I just hit my foot on the ground you, or a table, you can see you can see it move. So it's very sensitive. Um, and right now that bar is just oscillating back and forth. Uh, it will eventually end up bending one way or the other, but it's very sensitive and you, it's not easy to take data. The, the, the way to take data is to actually rotate the masses back and forth to get that bar to swing back and forth. So right now with the masses in these locations, that bar should be bent this way. Uh, and if I switch them, it should move to the other side. So let's just move these masses and see if we get a change. So it should move uh, to the right. And sometimes you just need to tap it. The stick can get stuck too. Okay, so it's moving a little bit to the right. I don't know if you can tell. It was, it was right here. Now it's right there. So it is indeed moving. Um, again, it's not a simple experiment. It takes a while. I do want to do this uh, just for fun. Here's my uh, spray. What's it called? Fantasy spray, professional haze. That look cool. Oh, you know, let's see. What's that thing from? That's just, that's just from, yeah, that's true. Okay, the end.